Hello everyone, you're watching Riddles for your channel. Are you ready for Detective Eric's Riddles? And also, there are socks hidden in the video, try to count them all! Freddy, the director of a small office that does printing and photocopies, called Eric and asked him to drop by as soon as possible. When Eric got there, he discovered that many printers, machines and PCs were stolen. Freddy was very depressed. He ran up to Eric. Freddy, you won't believe this, Eric. Yesterday I've been working late, and even when all my employees went home, I was still working on my computer. Then suddenly the power went out and my screen went black. I got disappointed and was about to leave when I heard the doorbell. When I opened the door, a masked guy broke into the office with a flashlight pointed to my face. I was blinded, so I stepped back and then felt a heavy bump on my head. When I came to senses, the burglar was gone as well as most of our equipment. Eric frowned. Nice story you got there, Freddy, and any detective would believe it, but not me. Why did he say that? Freddy claims that the power went out, then how the burglar rang the doorbell. This doesn't add up. Eric came to a crime scene where a store showcase was smashed and many valuables were stolen. Eric recognized the style of an experienced criminal, Maria. He promptly got to the car and went to her place. Maria was standing next to her sister Gloria. Eric approached them. Eric. A jewelry store has been robbed this morning. The showcase was smashed. This really looks like your style. Maria What nonsense, detective! I'm done with that. Now I'm clean. Besides, look, my arm hurts. Do you really think that I was able to rob a store in this condition? Gloria I can confirm that my sister is innocent. Eric went back home, but he received a call from his assistant Douglas and was informed that a suspicious-looking woman, Glow, was found at the scene. Then Eric went to Maria's house again and met her on the doorstep. Eric, a Glow was found at the store, a woman Glow. Maria, good for you, this would make a stupid motive to suspect me, anybody could leave it there. Eric. True, but I'm sure that you were the one who robbed the store, and Gloria apparently is your partner in crime. Why did Eric think so? When Eric met Maria for the first time, she had her left arm bandaged, and for the second time, it was her right arm. Like the video if you really missed the summer already. Find the odd object. Try again, find the odd object. Eric had a funny case. One day, he received and was told that a dangerous criminal called One-Eyed Jack has escaped high-security prison in Brazil on Christmas Eve. There was information that he was heading to Nice. Eric arrived at the airport knowing only few details. Jack had a beard and his eyes were okay, in fact, he received the nickname because of his habit to squint with one eye. 
Eric found four bearded men who were heading to Nice and briefly interrogated them. Eric, which one of you is Jack from Brazil? Man number one. I am from Brazil, but my name is John. Man number two. I'm from England. Man number three. What is this all about? Man number four. I am from Sweden, gentlemen. Eric, the three of you are free to go and you, sir, will have to stay. Whom did Eric address this? Eric detained the one who said that he's from Sweden, he's lightly dressed and it's summer in Brazil on Christmas. And how many socks have you found in the video? Don't forget to let me know in the comments! Thumbs up! Subscribe to our channel and ring the bell so you won't miss our latest videos!